I cannot wait till somebody looks at this video and goes, dude, what do you know about console streaming? Look, buddy, I have about two years worth of experience more than you do. Trust me. I'm here to help you guys get your streams from looking as crappy as they are to as professional as possible because of how limited you have with the streaming software of Xbox and especially Sony. Because honestly, those things suck. I'm here to help you. If you don't want to listen, click off now. Or if you do want to listen, sit back and watch. Or the intro. Before the video starts, I can say huge shout outs to my streams over on Facebook Gaming. I stream any chance I can, mainly Monday, Wednesday, Friday. So if you have any questions about this video, want to see uh, my setup live, want to see me dominate on Apex, or just want to talk like some most people do, uh, the link will be in the description down below. Let's talk about your console stream. Look, before I get into my tips here, I would like to at least say and address one thing. This is not for those streamers out there who currently are streaming through, let's say something like this, this thing called the Elgato uh, or through another capture card. This video is not for you. These are This video is for people who are directly streaming to Twitch, to YouTube, to Facebook gaming, to whatever platform they have directly through their console without any external capture cards that can go through a PC at all. Trust me. Some of these tips will apply to you if you do have an external capture card. Uh, some of these some of these tips will apply to you, but uh, a good chunk of them actually will not. So, all right. Let's talk about some of these tips. For this video, we're gonna break this down into two separate pieces. One is gonna be where your streams look at your appearance, and the other is what we're gonna be doing while we're streaming. Because trust me, there are some very wrong ways, and let's talk about that and how to fix those. All right, cool. Number one, I know this sounds like it's insane, but trust me, when it comes to streaming on the PS4, I tell so many people the first thing you need to do, take off that dumb, looking chat function. I know what you're thinking. What are you talking about? I'm talking about this chat function. You know where you get to press the check mark and you get to see your chat live? Yeah, get rid of that thing. It is completely useless, in my opinion. Yes, using seeing your chat live is a great option, but trust me, there are other ways and I will talk about those in a later video or anything else. But that thing, it looks ugly, it's so distorted, and not only is sense because on the PS4 streaming software that your preview window and your gaming window are basically the exact same thing, well, guess what? It reduces the size of your gameplay. So if you're playing something like, let's say, Call of Duty, a very highly competitive game, well, your minimum window that was 1080p went down to about 840p, and, uh, there's nothing you can do about it. Like, trust me, and trust me, it doesn't even help with getting through this kind of stuff. That preview window is complete garbage. And I tell anyone, if you're gonna stream, get rid of it. It looks clunky, it looks stupid. Get rid of it, rule number one. Let's move on to the next one. Next rule. I know this is a different one, and I tell everyone that buying products will not change your quality, but there are some basic products you're gonna need. And the first product you're gonna, gonna most likely need is uh, the camera. Like, if you're streaming directly through your PS4 or directly or on any uh, device, uh, I recommend that you get yourself a camera. For the PS4, it's uh, this PSN camera. It literally just hangs on the top of my monitor. And uh, for others, I think Xbox has its own camera as well as for other streaming softwares. You can get yourself a pretty decent Logitech C920 that I have right here. I just moved my fucking camera. Shit. <laughs> but <clears throat> that is what you can get. I recommend getting this camera. Though it is not the best camera out there, get yourself a camera. That is another top tier rule. Trust me, it'll make a difference in the long run. It allows the people to audience to actually see what you look like to make a connection because most people are drawn to faces. So get yourself a decent camera. I know people say that, uh, this camera sucks, and trust me, it does, but with some good, decent lighting, you can make this camera look from horrible to pretty decent, actually. So what another one? Look, I know this one's gonna sound a little more of a harsher, 
or is gonna not make sense to especially to develop those who have done their research and everything. And that is, I tell people another top thing you can do to make your streams look better is to add overlays to your stream. Now I know what you're thinking. Leon, what the heck are you talking about? You cannot do that. In the PS4 streaming software, they don't really add or allow you to use overlays. It's the same thing with Xbox. You cannot do it. Well, that's actually wrong. For those people who stream on Twitch through your PS4, which is the only one of only two places that you can stream to, uh, there's a place called on Twitch called Twitch Extensions. If you don't know what that is, I please trust me, those things can be very useful at times. But the one you're looking for right now is something called Overlay Expert. This extension itself will allow you to add overlays to your stream. All you have to do is sign in, sign up for the beta, and basically you're off to go. Uh, if you want more help with it right now, I will make a video on it when I can. But for right now, uh, I can recommend just going and look up some YouTube video on Overlay Expert on how to add uh, simple Twitch uh, overlays to your stream easy yes it won't be the thing about it is that you actually won't be able to see those streams while you're you know watching a stream on while someone's watching a stream on their phone but for those out there who are watching on the computer uh, you can see the streams and the overlays the stream overlays pretty pretty easily so i do recommend it i don't know what you're thinking those are gonna look horrible you can go find yourself a pretty decent uh easy simple little uh Overlay, trust me, when I started out, uh, this is what my stream used to look like. Like, shit, it, it looked like that. It, it looked like that, like, my face cam was down here in the corner and you'd have my top up here, my name. I'd use those bars to show my followers and uh, to subscribe to my freaking YouTube channel and then you have the stuff that you have down here. Trust me, it can be useful, I do recommend it. It helps your stream looks a little more professional. All right. Trust me, it'll make your streams look a lot more professional. Watch it. Look up a YouTube video on it. It'll help out in the long run. All right. Next one. I know this is not really considered uh, a, an appearance, but this does completely fall under that professional quality. And that is audio i know what you're thinking audio what are you talking about i'm talking about getting yourself a pretty decent microphone to start your streaming up there now streaming i do recommend that anytime you stream through a console on anything you get yourself an, an external microphone like this blue yeti here or heck like this fi fine down here i recommend it because it helps boost your quality by a mile most people, they use their microphones that are on their headsets down here, and that does not help. Trust me, those microphones are not built for good quality and good audio. They're not. They're meant to be simple and short and just to the point, enough that your teammates can hear you. That's it. But if you want to make your streams sound as professional as possible, I'm gonna recommend go getting yourself a simple USB microphone. If you would like uh, some tips and uh, some of my own ideas of what are some good microphones, I recommend I will be making a video on that as soon as possible. Hopefully, it's probably actually after this one. But get yourself a USB microphone. Trust me, it changes your quality by a mile. And trust me, I don't want to go into someone's stream where their audio is does not sound good. It does not sound good. It does not look good. I wouldn't want to do it. I got a feeling most people don't want to have some scratchy looking sound, bad sounding audio for your streams. Get yourself a USB microphone. Yeah, let's move on. I think that's everything. Yep, move on, move on, move on. Well, I think that's everything that we have for appearance professionalism. I think now we should talk about what you should be doing while you're streaming. So. Rule number one, I tell everyone that while you're streaming, I do recommend to keep looking at your chats and uh, doing your best to maintain sound or well, maintain talking as much as possible. The reason I do this is because your streams, I don't want those streams to actually be as boring as possible. Trust me, 
if a person goes in one of those low times, they're just going to leave. And I recommend every streamer to do their best to keep the entertainment as high as possible. There are easy ways to do this. If you have problems with talking to yourself, uh, play a game that's a multiplayer game like Overwatch, Call of Duty, Apex Legends, where you have teammates. Those things can help and have conversation with those teammates. And every now and then, look at your chat. If someone comes in, boom. You can have a simple conversation with them. Tell them how they're doing. Ask them how their day's been going. You get the idea. It's pretty easy. I recommend it. Talk to yourself or have people talk to you when it comes to chat. Trust me, do your best. I know you're an awkward gamer. I am too. Just find a way to keep yourself from staying quiet. Because trust me, that will destroy you from getting viewers. Talk about another one. All right. I think this should be the final tip of the night. And that is one of my things that I tell every single streamer. And that is do not damn play any damn music while you are streaming through your speakers. I know what you're thinking, Leon, what the heck are you talking about? There are people out there who do this and I hate it. People who, who take their speakers, say screw the rules, screw copyright, screw everything. And I'm just gonna play Bruno Mars on your damn speaker. I tell those people, do not do it. It is not good. I did it at one point in my, my time. Do not do it. Because if you're not following that rule, you're probably not following any of the other rules that I've set so far, like getting a decent USB microphone. And you're gonna be playing that through your headset. And let me tell you something, as I said earlier, the audio is not good in any way. Meaning that it's not gonna sound good to your viewers at all and those people are just gonna want to leave like i said earlier your best goal is to make as good sound as, qual as possible and background noise like your speaker people in the background and anything else is gonna disturb that it's gonna make people want to leave trust me i've been i've literally went down the twitch page clicked on somebody random and the first thing i heard was copyrighted not only just copyrighted music just music playing through a speaker that I could hear through their headphones, through their microphone on their headset. And it just did not sound good. I instantly left. I told, I don't recommend any good starting streamer to do that. All right. All right. So I think, I think that's everything. I think that's everything that I have currently on my monitor over here. Yeah, I've been through literally everything. And I think that's it for tonight. Look, I can't give out all my secrets. I can't, I, cause I gotta make multiple YouTube videos and it is literally one in the morning. Literally. It is literally one in the morning. I, I gotta go to bed, all right? I gotta go to bed. If you did like this video, found any of these tips helpful, I do recommend checking out my streams. The link will be in the description. Subscribe to this channel if you have not. Like this video, share it with all your friends out there and I'll see you boys later. Have a good night because I need to get myself some sleep. Take care.